Jim Holly, Supercross Live on SupercrossOnline.com. Here he is, Justin Braden, number 10. You know, number 10 was one of my old national numbers. Nice. That's awesome. I like it so far. I was happy seeing you in that heat race at Anaheim, man, win that one for number 10. That was good. Uh, but what happened in that main, man? Yeah, like you said, we started off with a bang and uh, got a great start in the heat and uh, and won that, which that was exciting. I was confident going into the main. And just, uh, just a bad start leads to, you know, riding with guys that uh, – I shouldn't be riding with and uh, making a lot of mistakes. I ended up crashing twice, so obviously not the result. But there's a, a lot of things to build on, so we've had a positive week of riding and uh, look forward to tonight here in Phoenix. Yeah, you mentioned that. I mean, you were outside the uh, top 10. I mean, you were way back in 16th, but I got to ask you, what's the difference between the start in the heat race and the start in the main? Because you killed it in that heat race. Yeah, I actually had a really good start in the main. I've uh, The team and I have looked at pictures and stuff, and about five feet across the gate looks like I might have had the whole shot and uh, I hit a rock or something hit a hole in the in the dirt and it popped my whole shot device up and popped me into a wheelie and then me and Chad kind of tangled and uh, that was all she wrote and um, you know I was I was inside the top 10 twice actually and crashed both times so uh, like I said there's a lot to build on and I uh, look forward to Phoenix tonight. You attribute those uh, two crashes to maybe uh, first race jitters or something, or trying to push too hard, knowing that man, I won this heat race earlier tonight. I'm back here outside the top ten. Yeah, for sure. I think just a little over anxious. Obviously, I belong in the in the top ten, or that's where I think I belong. If not, well inside. Wait, the I got I got to interrupt you there. I think this kid belongs in the top five, man. Yeah, for sure. That's what I was gonna say. That I uh, I belong up front, and to see the leaders getting away like that was kind of frustrating. And uh, just one thing led to another, and you know, little mistakes, but. But I learned, I feel like that's going to happen to probably all of us at some point. It's a long series and uh, just need to get a really good start in the main and, and get out front with the lead group and, and be gone. All right, you heard it from Justin Brayton. It's round two, maybe a little bit of uh, nerves are out of the way and maybe another heat race win and possibly a podium.